nice little suited connector in the small blind for Phil Homies who wants to dance. Chanowski's jack four. The Robbie into the bin and eight, wow. ten, nine. Bottom two oh, pair man. for Phil Helmuth. The overcard for Jones and top pair, top two pair rather, for Rigby as disaster awaits Helmuth. Jones in third place. Indeed, disaster somewhat awaits here. Rigby's such a hard guy to fold to with what we've seen over the years. <laughs> Phil knows that raise in front of him. Let's see how Helmuth proceeds. Wet texture as well, Nick, in terms of straight and flush draw combos. So Helmy does flat the 8,000. Now a fact not lost on Rigby, who is going to be heads up moving forward, is that Helmy likes to slow play and trap. Rigby just making change there for Phil. He did elect the call, as you said. Check. Just south of 30 in there. See if Elmuth can somehow avert tournament disaster. That is not an averting kind of card. Not at all. The Deuce of Hearts, two-tone texture develops, 28-4 in the middle, as the dark check from Phil draws a second barrel from Rigby. Sizable, 36K, and you can see the discomfort for Phil, who has made a reputation of folding big hands from time to time. Would this be one of them? Let's observe, Fabi. I'm all in. in. Uh-oh. Looks like Mr. Oh. Helmuth's drawn to a nine. Wow. Big hands. Two small pair, nines and tens. Big hands. Ace, ten. Wow. No. Wow. That's it. Wow, wow, wow. That's a big hands. Some big hands. Cue the boys to men, Nick. End of the road. <laughs> As Rigby. As Phil. Hunting Nina and Nina alone. To avoid the locker room early here on day 2D. 217,000 chip pot. Can he get lucky and stay alive? Good GG, sir. Again. We've got our answer. I sent. And it's no. Goodbye. As Nick Rigby That's claims the balls. most decorated of pelts in game, all of no. poker. Again. 17-time bracelet oh, winner who picked one up this yeah. summer already. Phil Helm yeah. is showing some sportsmanship. Very nice. Yeah. But being shown the exit. Oh, it was aces here for Chemelski. Jacks <laughs> for Modans. Rigby with 10-8 suited, who seems to have put the most chips in of anybody. Good luck, gentlemen. Top pair and a flush draw. You can kind of understand it. Am I seeing this right, that Rigby is 3-bet to 116,000? Let us get up to speed. It was a raise to 5,000 from Modans, a flat from Chemelski, as well, well as Rigby. Let me just say before, I, I didn't see the flop, so now it does, of course, make a lot more sense, but please go on. Modans followed through for 5,500. Chemelski raised it up to 19,000 on the strength of the aces, which were slow played pre, and then the three bet to 116 dimes from Rigby. Modans has already called in front of Chemelski for the rest of his stack, and now real concerns for Chemelski with the aces about whether or not his hand is any good here. It, it gets a bit sick multi-way. And I suppose the ace of spades, it's a multifaceted card on the one hand more equity if we're beat. But on the other hand, it interferes with a myriad of flush draws that we would yeah. like to be up against, so right. to speak. If the nut flush draw is not part of the kit that we're up against here, then we begin to have more concerns about sets. <clears throat> That's right. Many dreams are broken by pocket aces in the main event. Jamal's of course, the Red Jacks all in and in dire straits. Oh. Does put it in. Yeah. Wow. And once he does, Rigby knows he's got his work oh. cut out for him now. The good news, of course, Rigby is deep enough to cover both players. One out. <laughs> Spade, Jack, ten, or an eight. On time. And he'll break two hearts at once. It just feels like Rigby's going to win this pot. <laughs> Very well may not, but he's been running white hot so far tonight. feels like he is. For Modans, he's hunting the jack of clubs. It's a lonely card to be pursuing. That is, that is lonely, and for Chmelski, if the spades come, he'd love for them to come on the turn. Of 
course, that would allow him to redraw to the bigger flush with the ace of spades. And it's had an ultra clean deuce of diamonds. Jack of clubs. No straight draw acquired by Rigby. It's now Chalowski, the clear favorite, 67%. Can he claim the whole thing? No, he can't. <laughs> As a five of spades rolls off on the river and showers Modans and Chemelski. Wow. Good game, gentlemen. Thanks. Double knockout. Sin Ren Chen. Note that China's Lu in there with ace queen closing things. Could have one somewhat brewing between Chen and Rigby. Top pair versus bottom pair. As the ace queen comes up empty. And following through for 7,000, Rigby. A quick call for a Diamond's interaction. A lack of interaction, of course, for Mr. Liu. He's in as well, Ali. Interesting. Yu Yan Liu. Wants to see the turn, and it is a fantastic turn for Rigby, who's now picked up the diamond draw and a gutter. Both the ace X's have also picked up a gutter of their own. That card not appearing to be of concern for Sin Ren Chen. Let's see if Rigby goes for raise as opposed to call. Both seem like ideas. Looks like he is just going for call. Lou, of course, has seen enough at this point. 22,000 a man as we're down to heads up in an almost 80K pot, and the river is top two for Chen. Decides to check it over to Rigby, and he jams. Puts him in, Ali. Now, here's the thing. Nick. Rigby with the reputation for playing that diaper, the deuce three. Wow, the, the presence of the diaper in his range <laughs> is uh, very daunting at this point. You're right. 94 bigs all in. It's a bit, it's a little bit sick for Chen. Oh. Does get through. Bravo, sir. Legend grows. <laughs> Into the bin it goes okay. as Nick Doesn't Rigby. Doesn't show it, Ollie. Gets that one through. No question that a pair of threes was not the Are winner. I think he is going for squeeze, and let's see how this plays out. Rigby so capable of taking a flop. It's one of the things we love about watching him, but this is still a little bit dicey with just 10-7. Looks like he's just something of snap in. Go on, Rigby. And that's where it gets real with a hand like ace-10 off out of position. He does have Rigby dominated, so this is something of a great spot as we see Grant fold, but out of position is right. so... Real. 580 in the middle. By the way, Dolce and Gabbana responsible for the eyewear here. Rigby looks incredible. He really does. I mean, how about this flop? Is it the ace of hearts for Livshitz? It is indeed. And of course, the middle flush draw for Rigby. How about this flop indeed? And I'll tell you what, all that we're getting off of Livshitz here is authentically displeased. I, I would have to agree that he did sigh in a certain manner, but it doesn't. 175? He goes for 175. Let's see. It, what it doesn't do is prevent him from barreling 17.5. Frigby's attack immediately cuts out chips. He's so just kind of on you. Mm -hmm. See a oh. turn. Excellent card for Livshitz to barrel. In terms of a lot of that ace-king kind of kid? Yeah, he has a lot of the ace-king stuff. He can have king-jack. And he can just have more hands that contain a king in them than Rigby. Although Rigby has a lot of king-x suited. Let's see. 
He is doing this sort of behavior. He's not really giving anything off to me, though, Ali. Well, he's far from stoic. And note that Grant's looking on with some interest here. Has he been to King Jack? 375. I like this a lot from Liv Schiffs. Rigby's trying to hit the heart, maybe find a way to win it without hitting it. Lifshitz doesn't know that, though, as he has now got himself out of position against Rigby in a 1.7 million chip pot where he is unimproved on the river. Same reality, however, for Rigby. All in? He oh does do it. God. Bravo, sir. Great play. Even though he has the best hand, that's a really great play. The conclusions are foregone at this point in terms of Rigby. Just something of a Hollywood, keep them yeah. guessing. Sure. What a statement jam this is from Livshitz, by the way. The man's here to play and unafraid to put his main event life on the line, out of position against one of the stickier customers at his table, and he's done it to great effect. Bravo, Gabby, that's big time right there. Yes, 2. sir. 2.75 now for Livshitz. True from time to time, light. You can get them looking you up light. Give action, get action. You gonna give me something on my chips back? Let's go, go to war. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just play a poker hand. Live shits. Defends the big and flops himself an open ender with the backdoor diamonds. Checks with the flow, 140K out there, and Rigby barrels. 110. 85,000. Am I sorry? I believe it was 110. 110. 110. Oh, forgive me. For lift shit's a very comfortable check. I prefer check lavender if you're going to advance in the hand. Oh, he's making a lavender request. Here we go. <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard that before. Strong. Under the assumption that the pot's headed his way, right? And Lifshitz kind of does, does oblige and flick in the lava during the two maroons. 360 out there. Oh. Ace of hearts out 300, there. 300,000. No Rigby right away goes for 300. It, it's a little bit interesting. It's very kind of mergy. He only has queens now. Naturally, he falls to any turned ace. Again, lavender is much appreciated. Once again, it comes with the lavender request. And you'll remember Lipschitz jammed with ace high after barreling three streets against Rigby. He's not intimidated by Nick. No, and that was a really good jam because if he checked, I think we we all know what was happening. So it, it was almost defensive in nature, even though he had the best hand. He has a stranglehold on this one precariously yeah. close. Check, check. Ace. Fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, Rigby's sick. Guys, get the fuck out of here, he uh, said. I mean... Speaking of parking lot, there were two ace jacks folded. Sorry to interrupt that. It's okay. Or one ace jack folded, then Dosberg played it, suited. Very big table. <laughs> Rigby with the dirty pull up again. Kid's gotten a little older, he's out of the diapers, no running around me. with the pull ups now. Well, I should wonder why. Hey. Just still shitting everywhere. Can't stop him, Maria. <laughs> you know what they say, you can't beat him, join him. Yeah, it feels like Rigby's actually just gotten bored of playing the dirty diaper, that now he's really just trying to level up a little bit. He wants multiple hands to be coined he's older. by him. I think he wants multiple sponsors to support him. you got to stick with what you got you here then. You know, you can't be changing your skin. Well, and this also does certainly keep his opponents on their toes because they're expecting the three deuce, but they're not expecting the four three. Mm. Blindsiding him with a four tray. <laughs> you can't change your skin line, you're right, unless you are Stephen Chidwick and you are artificial intelligence. Boy, Stephen, I think that Wuhan was the beginning of the end for Stephen Chidwick last night. Is he out? He's out. Oh, jeez, Maria. Sorry yeah. about that. The look on his face, you know, even before he folded that hand, it just... And look at this. Passion. Rigby 
is, is what happened here? Wow. Rigby doing Rigby things. Look, he, he raises up with the pull-up. The back door straight draw, I guess, Maria. And Very close to zero equity. And gets king-queen and ace-jack to fold. But Bill is legitimately yeah. thinking about this. Can you see what it says? With 94% mm -hmm. equity and oh, ace-5. I mean, I what is going on here? I just want to watch this hand. It's hard because you see Klein only has 625k. And he would love to try to realize what he thinks he needs, the equity of the, the back doors. But uh, it's going to be hard. But Maria, what would Rigby make this All raise in. with? And All in. in! Yes! I, I lo love it! Oh my gosh. Bill Klein, hero, man of the people. Wow. Rigby knows he can't call. <laughs> it looks like he's been hit by a big rig. He feels gross. Yeah, his kid is screaming. There's poop all over the pull-up. It's a nightmare situation for Rigby right now. What a shove from Bill Klein. Oh, my I God. Love, Bill Klein kindly Klein. counting it out. Holy cow. You know, I, I, I didn't <laughs> think I would say this, but Bill Klein might be even better to have on the feature than Mr. Wu. He's got the Wuju. How dare you, Maria? Yeah. <laughs> Wow. Well he's done. Shot. Oh, and wow. he showed the winning hand. <laughs> wow. Oh, my God. But when you was think about hand. it, it's brilliant because it's such a strong shove. It's like Rigby check oh, raise. Bill Klein, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Half of Bill's stack. Sandy <laughs> Ovation. Maria, that one was for Bill you, Klein. Oh, oh, baby. We bow. <laughs> wow. Bill's we bow. Nice wow. He doesn't get aces. He's not supposed to get aces. Raise. Yep. Raise Just normal business. On the button and... Look at this. Chance's big blind. What's Chance got? Oh, oh my Ace king of hearts. Well, over 100 bigs deep. Here we go. Wow. Feature table was not kind to Chance a couple years ago. Did he speak to Jeff today or something? Is that why this is happening? I don't know. He's always got a smile. He's never bringing bad mojo to the tables. But he feels he's got Rigby. Because he knows what Rigby plays. Wow, an ace is for the Stoic. Mm. Stoic is kind of a stirring, like, oh, what do I do? What do I do? And this is where having a reputation like Rigby and also someone with a reputation like Chance even, you know, is really going to benefit Rigby because, you know, he might fire off some real light four bets in a button versus big blind spot, all you in. also know. Did he say all in right Shucks. there? Call. Oh. All. It's just going to get oh, it out. Oh, my oh. goodness. Chance Corneth, <laughs> welcome to the table. He is the shorter of these two monster stacks. Oh That's my wild. God. Wow, Rigby. Holy shit. Rigby just knowing. <laughs> it's been like this the whole. His man there. Yeah, it's Rigby in line to really. shoot up the leaderboard oh, once goodness. again with almost 6.3 million of his aces can hold. It's four bet shoving for 100 bigs, gets action. Bullets. Chance Corneth can't believe it. His fate riding on hearts and Broadway. No hearts. Queen of hearts. Worse, worse flops than that one. Yeah, queen of hearts. One heart nice. there. I'd love a sweat. Four diamonds. I already that's called greedy. the turn, that's sir. Greedy. So that's greedy. right, he called for it. Yeah, just so we're on All right, that's a rule. Page. It's you, a rule. You can ask for it on the It's river. not really a rule, it's a guideline. Four Whoa. diamonds, I fucking called it. Let's oh. fucking go! And that's it. Yeah. Wow. That's wild. Chance Corneth comes <laughs> here with over three million chips and immediately the hands them <laughs> off to Big Rig. Yeah. But... Does make the call. Building a pot over 1.1 million. Okay, well, now there's a double gutter. Queen, eight. Nice shove Here actually come. out of Klein with all of that equity. But I think I'm going to need help. Not going to get Rigby mm. off of call. top pair the tens. from the flop. You see the outs for Klein, his tournament life on the line. He's on his feet now. Queen, eight, ace, jack. Rigby, 11 ounce to dodge. Trying to knock off Bill Klein. Three of clubs. Through him for the double up. I had to say that before you rooted the queen in. You said whoever goes first, right? 
Ace Jack, Queen Eight to keep Klein in the main event here on day five. Four clubs. That's going to do it for Bill Klein. Another good run. Great run for the philanthropist. Always such a pleasure to watch Bill Klein play. And to be honest, I don't really feel like Rigby has been stoic at all today. Just calling out cards, seemingly too interested. Yeah, you see the scarf there? On yeah, I do see that, yeah. You can't stay out of the pot. The computer hand. Why is it called the computer? We all know why it's called the computer hand. Thank you, Lon. Computer hand is going to donk bet out here like Rigby likes to do so much. And this time, Rigby hits... And he's no good. Third place. It's kind of interesting because I assume that Wantman's going to call here. And then Heidorn's going to have to find an overcall with the best hand at the moment. But certainly makes it a little bit tougher. Oh, wow. Wantman's just going to fold. I mean, hmm. I get it because Rigby has shown that he has taken this lead line with a lot of top pair hands. But he's also done it with gut shots. He's done it with bottom pair. So I do think that it's a bit of a premature fold, but I do get with Heidorn behind, sometimes it might become a little dicey. This is going to be a premature ejaculation of chips from Rigby. 400,000 to the Euro. 5-4 does get there. And, you know, we talk about Rigby leading sometimes with draws, and certainly 5-4 can be one of those holdings. But... I don't believe Heidorn's going to go anywhere. Can still beat all the seven X's, six X's, flush draws, you know, the nine eights. Heidorn have a none of it. Oh, and Rivers a set. And Rigby may compel himself to bluff at this because. All in? All in? And this oh. is gross. Nine eight gets there. And I was just saying. Oh. Call. Euro. Wow. Good call. Pulls over the big rig and takes. CDU. Courtesy double up. For Hydorn. Wow. What Sorry. a spot. King's on the button. Against two players <laughs> with chips. Not any two players, though. True. One, one of them is mm. Nick Bigby. He's got a king crusher. But you see, Rigby knows how to navigate in these situations. Just calls with the A7. No, he's brilliant that way. Absolutely. He knows when to tiptoe. He knows when to barge through the door and hit his <laughs> ace. <laughs> it's it's at this point it's just funny because Rigby just manages to find a way to win the pot, whether it's out flopping kings or getting the best hand to fold. Just can't put a foot wrong, and yeah, he's going to lead, and Rampant's going nowhere with his kings. The spot that. Every recreational poker player has been put in, too. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, no way Rick has got an ace. He doesn't have an ace. Way, way tougher for the Kings to fold now, even despite this big stack. Oh, so many draws, Maria. Just that 500K <laughs> in the eye. <laughs> <laughs> he beats everything except aces. And would Rigby play an ace like this? <laughs> I mean, he would. That's the thing is we've seen him lead plenty of times with top pair. But he also, also... He might also play the diaper like this. Could also just play, you know, 10Xs like this as well. Oh, the rich get richer. Okay, well. Club on the river does bring in a 1.2 million. No 1 million. hesitation. Oh. 1.2 million. Vampin, Vampin looks really suspicious. He also looks like he has to call. He does. When you count up the chips that quickly, Maria, you're at least leaning that way. I uh, would like it better probably if he had the king of clubs, but still, again, against Rigby, could be back, anything. Back. back door of the clubs? Back door of the clubs. See, they just put Rigby on the hand that beats them. But Rigby didn't three bet the big blind. So hands like king, queen of clubs, queen, jack of clubs. Less likely. Vampin is really suspicious. And hands like strong ace is also really unlikely as well. Yeah, he can't make sense of it. Almost okay, half well, a stack to call. 
this is something that we haven't seen a lot of players do. It's just study rugby in these spots. A lot of times people are just putting the chips in just based on theoretical. Estelle the getting escorted from the table for too much phone activity there. And she's using GTO Wizard a lot. Mm -hmm. oh. Uh, he's gonna. Oh. No, he's Maybe. just assessing the damage here. He, he wants to see how much he'll have left if he makes this call, and he's wrong. All the hard work, five days just to put it in the back of a big rig. No. Hmm. But this is the point, right? Is when you're up against Rigby, you know that this is also how he gets paid off, is because he plays so many hands that you don't want to be that statistic. There oh. Oh. He's going to be the stat. Ah. Oh, look at that. So Let's sick. go, boys. Let's go, boys, indeed. And another victim. Leaves the whole way. Nice Has it again. Two queens. And this is going upstairs. And who better to deal with two queens than a Brit, right? But there's only been one queen in his life, actually. Great point. Lucky with a beautiful 9-8 of hearts, but no option here. Baiting. Less, uh, nope. What was he looking at? He's still looking at his chips. Rigby is uh, going to be really tempted with the jacket and spades. Yeah. Try to get his chips back from Toby Lewis. Nice little mono a mono battle building here. Oh my gosh! Wow! <laughs> what a flop for Rigby! It, yeah, doesn't matter what he plays, he's gonna hit. Two thirty-four. Great flop for Toby too. You can always in the ask diaper him if you want vicinity, more but yeah, they'll tell you. That's the queen of spades. Lewis has gone to the bank of Rigby once. This is going to be a trickier withdrawal than before, though. Mm -hmm. 500. 500. Let's go. Let's build a All pot. In. All in. There it is. And a call with the Queens. Toby Lewis is going to have to fade danger. You see the outs for Rigby up top. It is Toby Lewis, the one at risk. I hate to see all that equity from Rigby's hand, but. Got some action. Got to get in there. Yeah, spade or a five? <laughs> <laughs> Toby would it's take good, two good spades. It's good TV. Oh my God. If he's going to get a spade, like Toby wants to see it on the turn. So we can hit the other one. Oh, Jack. <laughs> oh my God. Whew. Close. Now the outs. Just want to see. Eight, five spade. Prefer Almost spade six million chip pot. Yeah, they're on the road. Ooh. <laughs> what a sweat. Oh, I can't Hard even. I can't watch, the guys. The river card. The tray of diamonds. And Toby Lewis safe once again. Doubles again through Big Rig. Listen, I got to say. I just break this. Toby Lewis is a great player, one, yeah. but he also is pretty lucky. And if someone can fade all those outs against Rigby, I'm not surprised to see it being Toby. Sounds like you might have some... Uh, Personal bias okay, against Toby. Did he suck out on you in the past, oh. Maria? No, nice Toby, I think, will be the first to tell you. You know, just kind of a, a nice um, guy, but sure, lucky, you know. lucky in life. Sure. Nine eight off for Vamp and Queen Jack off for Rigby. She, she Absolutely true. Okay, he must be all right. right. Oh, yeah. Don't have to die. No. Agreed. Oh, oh my. Rigby with the overs and the sure. gut shot. Vamp and somehow with the the flopped full house 275 in the middle Ollie and you know Rigby yeah. isn't going to mind peeling one off with the gutter and the two overs as we see 50 ahead hey what's up Darryl? how's it going delivered to the middle merciful turn check as Rigby is unimproved and let's see check. oh Vampin is looking to induce here as the board double pairs
Okay. Very nicely done from Vamp and the check back on the turn. Bait taken by Rigby as he goes full pot here. Now this is salesmanship as salivary glands activate for Vampen. <clears throat> and this is where those sort of subtexts make things weird. Well said, Ollie. Absolutely. All in. Ray's all in. Well, that is obviously a handcuffing way to go about this river for Queen High. <laughs> Rigby's annoyed. We do beat the small pairs on below the eight, but he is gone. Great pickup for Vampen. From day four and prior, in an effort to get a little bit of a scouting report on their compatriots. I the think table. so, yes. 6.25 to play now. That scouting report would certainly suggest the three betting with Ace Jack suited would be profitable against the. Rigby opening range. Not and for Rigby, sub 40 bigs, ace queen off, lot of hand. See what speaks to Pittsburgh's finest. Looks like he's going for call. Yeah. Roughly a third of his stack in there. Oh, and a lovely flop for his purposes. Queen five tray. It doesn't get much cleaner than that. For Rigby. Just oh, announced guys, all in. It was a hell of a run. Okay. Yeah. Wow, he just went all in straight away. He'll see the bad news, Ali. Brown drawing very thin, and for Rigby, an absolute stranglehold on this one. Kind of made the disclaimer, thought, you know, well, guys, it's been a hell of a run, just in case the Kings lurked, blocking the Aces and the Queens, of course. And we'll be thrilled to see Brown with Ace Jack suited. He could draw dead on this turn. Yeah, well, million chip pot would here. take Rigby back to his starting stack on the day, but oh, not the card he wanted to see. Suddenly, Brown hunting a king. Yeah, king queen. Nervousness in Camp Rigby, it would appear. Oh. Not like this. Take it down, Rigby. Was that a human air horn? <laughs> I think it was. <laughs> Queens for Vampa. 9-7 suited for Rigby. They tussle once again. Middle pair in the back door. 430 out there already. Remember, Vampa piled on Rigby. And that flopped the boat. And a check back on the turn, which induced Queen High to fire. That's the last data point we've got. And of course... <laughs> the contentious exchange prior to the dinner break with Vampen calling clock. Preflop action here, Rigby the opener. 
on day 75. And this is where Rigby... Uh, this further was on. a vampin yeah. open from the button. I don't know. I don't Rigby know. defense, but like Rigby then led right out on this texture, which sure, just witnessed, like and now barreling once that. more oh, at a flat 135 again. Very nice. Yes, this is this is where Rigby's mergy kind of style becomes very annoying for vampin now. Just queens, so to speak. Turn is a bit annoying as well. See if Rigby finds oh, a way. Was that 135? For the queens. Yeah. Of five back. Perhaps some discrepancy with respect to how much he deposited. Oh, and oh. That's as comfortable as it gets for Vamp and the Queen of Clubs. What a card. Only downed by pocket aces and 5 6, neither of which rate to be a part of the equation for Rigby, who is checking. This oh, looks like Rigby snapped. Is that I think right? That makes sense. Pretty sure he snap called, Ali. Sure looks that way. Let's go. We hit a queen. We were probably good. He's clean. One man Five rail one, huh? elated. Clean. Shout out Peanut M &Ms, by the way, being massacred by that gentleman yeah. on the rail. Oh, in May of this year, it was it a in. bit familiar. Huh? With the seven, I only have two cards. With the ten queen, I have twelve and full potential. You know you didn't have a flush draw. There wasn't a flush draw on the floor. Is this yeah, Ripley's Achilles well, heel? His no, just no, no. desire. Did you think it was three clubs? To not yeah. concede no, in a spot like sense. this. Oh, go ahead, Rigby. Scared money doesn't oh, make money, baby. I did. Oh, he did, yeah. Really 1.6 in yeah. the middle. Oh. We're about to find out, Ali. I thought Ali. afterwards you made a comment like, I finally had to be might sick. Might have a read on the deck. It's going to work. Yeah, that's this doesn't go his way. <laughs> a two to one favorite. I thought there were two clubs on Yeah. No, I... Mm. I thought I understood the club part. Yeah, I you, you see him looking over like, I'm sorry. Another club. Nope. Why are you calling? I needed Something that I said. Oh, Although it wasn't possible. Here's Rigby's girlfriend. I needed, I needed that Looking on with it. great interest. Although it wasn't possible. Works. He plays a 1.6 million chip pot. He's asking for the 6.8.9. No six, waiting eight, for the 10 in the window. 10.9.6. Oh, Awfully good for Rigby. Awfully bad for Heidel. Good fold, good fold, good fold. Gutter no sweating about that. Ooh, the outs oh, just got longer. We go from six outs to ten. In camp hide one. Not out. Queen gives them a bad strength. Can he hit and stay alive here on day five? Good no. Yeah. Yeah. They love it, Ali. Rigby's rail. Oh, man. Have fun, guys. See you next year. See you, man. Well, it's painful, but fun. Yeah, it's right. Cheers, man. I like this guy. Not sure, though, but did he have the circle beard? It really? He was only on, on the camera a few times. Mostly just voice. I'm probably wrong, but... What are you out there in the Xbox Live streets? Not, not really, not that much. But I, I had a period where, where things were going down. As we see the three bet to five twenty-five. Yeah, on the topic of things going down, another Rigby three not quarter. one to go quietly. Soik with nines. Interesting. Just nines, if you will. But again, the Rigby factor. He's out. Rigby with a snap. You know, he just murdered it. a high noon. Right. It got tossed him, just murdered it, crushed it immediately. 1.2 in the middle. Heads up. Yeah, that, that was an expedient bit of hydration. And a very cozy flop Check. for Tamanini. A dominant ace queen with the nut flush draw. Rigby. 
presumably would find them up promptly in the face of follow through here from Tomanini, but just one and a half back, slightly north of one SPR. Reaching. Rigby check jams with Jack Queen of Clubs, Ollie. Four of spades, five, seven of hearts. Perhaps. Here we are. I mean, this would be a sick beat for Tamanini. No sooner do I make presumptions about Rigby's navigation in the face of follow through here than he just rams the queen jack suited. I kind of looked away, to be honest. I assumed surely this one is a wrap. But you I like really my chances, but I didn't know. really said that. <laughs> That's my name. When Nick Rick is involved, Dolly. Like this would be a good viral video. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is, you win this queen way. jack of clubs is in the 10 and even that. press. I was taking like a six there. One fill. Jack of spades, jack of diamonds, the only disastrous developments for Tamanini, all else. And he doubles through. In style as well. Yeah, nuts on the river. And Just like that, Rigby will slide. One point some odd over to Tamanini. Right. Rigby's heartbeat, you're just wrong, you know. Can I ask for a small color up before the end of the day? A small color up. A7-5 with a couple of spades says Soik's sixes. Hoping to get it over with quickly. How good. Not gonna happen. Mm -hmm. How good. But I didn't get stopped. 150 pre, 150 post. Pot goes oh, to 750 in the six of clubs. Pretty good. And Soik with a naughty check. That's I a can't even lie to you, so. Ace King Jacks. The ace. Queens. Six is gonna full for anyway. Soik, and boy, he is begging for Rigby to have ace. I figure if I make it on the other side, it just looks terrifying. Provided that it's not ace is full, of course. Does not rate to be the case. Probably still bad, but... You got full double for me. King I feel a snap coming. Well, it, looks like he's, size it, it looks like he's really reaching, Ollie. 750 in the middle. Overbet? I thought he was initially, looks like 800, so essentially full pot just north. Well, we faded the snap. Such a bad river. I had to put 80 bigs in against Yuri the other day with Ace King, so. Uh, I put in 80 bigs against Yuri. What he means by that three. is it's a good river but in a sense, he making it bad, that river, if you will. A hard river to yeah. fold, so to speak. But in the face of this 800 into I, 750, I knew I wasn't going to fold. hijack caught to off. The, you know, Tricky. Put it on. Tomorrow, tomorrow. Thank you very much, though. Considered plotting, but. Rigby's beaten, but not in the manner uh, that he expects. Two more. The concerns centering around trip aces. Some size. And he does pay it off. He'll see the bad news, Holly. Pretty gross. Rigby's sick. Doesn't show it. He only has 20 bigs to start, oh. and we have an all in. Can I have a count, please? Mm -hmm. I like this all in. Hi, Definitely need to go. 
Yeah, a little less than. He's all in as well. Rigby does need to make a move today. I mean, you know, he's less than half the chip average. And uh, he certainly sure. does not shy away from the moves. Well, this is definitely standard from Rigby, you know, against an eight big blind shove after Rigby opens. Certainly no fold equity available. When you have ace, ten of diamonds, definitely ISOing is also important. And Yachtman, I mean, you're not really considering calling 20 bigs here. No, he's getting great pot odds with his pretty hand, which he'd like to see for no more chips if he could. Yeah, that's too much. Too much. Suited connectors, no good. <laughs> Suited connectors, no good for the yeah. moment. So, Yep has a head with his ace jack against the suited ace 10. Let's go, let's go one time. Of Rigby. As Jota. A 10 or diamonds. Yes. Okay, you know that sorry. You can just find the YouTube later. He's go. pretty good about calling cards. <laughs> <laughs> there will be evidence. So hand number one. Rigby picking up where he left off late last night here. All in and a call. 149 beginning this hand. 149. 47 men, two women. <coughs> He's still good. Rigby sitting very stoically. Rigby has the S10. Or chop possibilities. Help. A 10. Would knock out Yepes. Luis Yepes looking to hang on. Another queen comes down. Binga! Yep. Binga! Double up. We're going to move away for a moment. Something going on. Rigby oh. shoved with the jacks. The Aquilio with ace king of clubs. 1.5 Rigby under the gun, plus one. All in. All in. Not much more than Rigby has, so you have to listen to his all in a little more carefully. Put his all in button. Use it. It's clear. Looks like this is going to clear the field and. Another big flip incoming. Look, boys. All right. Classic Grace. Rigby with the Jacks all in. Ace King of Clubs, Diego De Quilio. The crypto startup guy trying to end Rigby's main event. Stoic. All right, here we go. Can Rigby's jacks hang on? Well. Wow. It hits the jack, but watch out. This table has brought Broadway Ooh. more than once. Yeah, the overcards are out of the question, but those gutter balls have been coming in nice and clean. See the outs for Daquilio. Six of spades on the turn. One card to come. Ooh, Rigby wow. trying to avoid the queen. Oh, my gosh. And no. the queen hits on the river once again. A shocking knockout river card at this feature run, table. Man. Game, man. <sighs> I didn't think he was going to get up. Unbelievable that he goes down on the four outer on the river. He's seen it. He's been there. He's watched the occurrences at this feature table. And he walks away disgustedly. Yeah, 